Okay, we're doing another sew along. This is Norfolk sew along, and I'm excited to do this one. Remember what that looks like? Look at the block. That is the block I will be doing this time. Yes, it has a star in the middle, but I am excited about it being in a frame. So, you want to see how I'm going to do this? You come on back. I've never, I've never worked with um, Scribe, so this is going to be interesting. So, if you want to see how I'm going to put it together, come on back and join me. And I'll see you in a bit. Thank you. All right, guys, I got all my pieces cut and labeled. First thing I'm going to do is the triangles. This is my triangles. I got them. Got the lines on them. I showed y'all how to do triangles before. So that will be my first task. And I'm going to make the triangles and then turn them into hourglass blocks. I just showed y'all how to do that also. But I can give you a refresh on that. I'm going to do these triangles right here. And I'll be back. Alright guys, I'm making the hourglass blocks with the two triangles, half square triangles. And what you do is you just match them up together. The black on the white in the back. See, you want it to look like that. See? You want it to look like that. <laughs> That's not right. I think I need to hold on y'all. I need to turn them around. Okay, here we go. You want them to look like this. So you've got your black on your white there. I know I've shown these before. And I got my line drawn. See my draw line? So I'm gonna draw the line and I'm gonna finish them up. And I'm gonna make those and I'll come back and let you see. All right, I'll be right back. Okay, I got my hourglasses sewn. And this is what they're gonna look like when I get through. I gotta cut them in the middle here and this is going to give you two hourglasses. Remember these, right? All right, I'll be back as soon as I get them done and start, um, I guess, assembling the blocks. See what else needs to be sewn together before I come back, but I'll be back. All right, guys, I got all my little hourglasses did. Now, these right here, you see these? They got to have a, a white block on each side. Then I got, let's see if you can see that one. That just fell off. Then I got two hourglasses and one block, black pokey dotted center to do. So I'm going to do those, and I'll come back with another step on this block again. I'll come back and we'll put it together. But all these little pieces, I think I need to just go ahead and do and get them set up so we can just put on the block. And that's easy. You got your, you can see, if you can see here, they're, they're not going to be together. They're going to be separate. But I'm just going to put the little blocks on each side here of them. That's this unit I'm going to make now is this one. And then I have this one unit right here with two hourglasses I got to put, the black one. And <laughs> it's falling, y'all. I should have put it on my board, but I just had it on here. So I got to put two hourglasses in the black center. So I'm just going to fix those blocks up. And because they're little pieces and it's quite a few. And I'll be back to show you the rest of it. All right, guys, I got all my pieces cut and put together. These right here, I got to put together to make the center star. Then I got to put these together and these together. So that's what we're going to do right here. Um, on these right here, I actually had the, these going up and down instead of across like this. So you have to pay attention to what you're doing there. So it looks like the first thing I'm going to put together is the star block. 
Yeah, that's what it looks like. So I'm just looking here, looking here, looking here. And this is a piece of it. And here's the piece. And here's the piece. You know, I've did these blocks all kind of ways. So, you know, making the hourglass and the whole nine. So I think I have did them, did stars every which way there is to do. But I'm really liking this block because this block actually it the stars in like a frame so i really do like this um first time i ever worked with the scrap material too so that was a plus so i'm gonna make this center block here with you guys and we're gonna put this baby together i had to wait for cookie to go sleep because cookie just just don't act right. She don't want to go to bed at night, y'all. I guess I'll be trying to, trying to t uh, keep club hours on me. I don't know. I guess she, she's just getting to that age. You know, they go through stages. So I had to get her down for bed. Been working on this block all day. Because, of course, she's going to come in and say, Mommy, Mommy, I need so-and-so. I got to go to the party. Man, I don't get none done. Try to make sure I don't cut. Which I did. I always cut a porn off, you know? I don't even worry about it. One day I may be good enough that I don't cut a porn off. But I don't even worry about it. You gonna, You're never going to even really notice it. Once it's all quilted and dolled up, you won't even pay no attention. No, you won't. So I didn't put no pins in it that time. This is making two blocks. So, but they are, I think, 15 by 15 big blocks. I'm going to make this one, and then I'm going to make the other one off camera. I'm not going to have y'all to watch me make both of them. So, I don't want to make these videos no longer than they have to be. So, we get this first one made. And then I'll do the other one off camera. And then we'll come back for the next step. And you won't believe it. All my seams are open. That's the way to etc. Open all my seams. So I open all my seams because these are small blocks and it's a lot of bulk. Yeah, it is. Yes. A lot. Just a bit unpin it. Yeah, or just a bit unpin it. So here's my first inner star. Ain't it pretty, pretty, pretty? So, uh, of course, these got to be open, too. But I'm going to make the next in, uh, star here. And I will come back and we will make the next blocks that need to be done. Uh, I will do one of each. And um, then we'll come back and put it together. I don't want to hold y'all up watching me make these blocks because if you didn't see what I was doing you can very well always pause the video that's what I do when I'm trying to learn something pause the video look at what you're looking for or you can slow the video down you can do that I used to do it all the time still do but I'm gonna press this one I'm gonna do the other one press this one and then we'll go to our next steps I'll be back. Well, I guess you don't want me to cut you off, but I'll be back. All right, guys. I got these done. Now, I think my next move is... Mm -hmm, a 
let's see. What's my next move, y'all? What's my next move? My next move will be putting these on. These strips on. So I'm going to get those. I'll do a couple with y'all just to just for the people deleted ones that maybe have not did this before. But we're gonna put these strips here on. Let them wind up here. This is easy peasy. I think all of the hard part is over with. Especially messing with those little bitty uh, pieces. The hard part is over with. Now it's just putting it together. Try to hold on to my tips there, y'all. I think I might have cut that one off. I'm gonna try not to cut that one off. Okay. Trying to hold on them tips. But I might have got that one. I might have got that first one because I was not paying attention. No, I was not. No, I didn't. I didn't get it. See? I didn't get it, y'all. Whew, sometimes I surprise myself. I'm gonna put this other one on. See, I'm just putting them on the sides here. And that's all I'm doing. That's all. But I just want to do it for you. Get these blocks together. Get them together. Get them gone. Because I'm so excited to see how it turns out. Even though it's a star. It's, it's a star. To me, it's a star in a frame. And I'm just loving this fabric here. Try not to cut my points out there. Well, I'm gonna miss both of these. How sweet it is! Mm -mm -mm. Yep. See, I got my points on each side, and then I think. My next step is putting, yeah, this is my next step, putting these on. And these are just three different scripts, two white ones in the middle one. This is what's going to make my block. So I'm going to put this one on. Yeah, we and I did those. I didn't think you need to see me sew three scripts together. If there's anything that I'm skipping in these that someone needs to see, let me know. And I will do another block of Sabbath. One of the dogs is scratching. They're right here outside the door where I'm at. Um, near, they're supposed to be in the bed in there. But anyway, if anybody needs to see something here that I'm doing, see it's coming together, y'all. There, look at that. There, that's cute, that's cute. That's what I'm so excited to see. Y'all need to see, just let me know. I keep cutting that sentence off. I will be more than happy. This is a big block, y'all. More than happy. Let me finish this sentence. I will be more than happy to accommodate you with that. Don't have a problem. And, you know, 
if you if you're new to quilting all this is not it's not um it's not knowledge it's not knowledge for you um you're learning and you know the worst thing to do is to watch somebody and you don't understand what they're doing so anybody have any problems with something i'm doing just hit me up in the comments i will send my email my email too because it usually tells me it's a comment or it's a youtube uh, comment so just hit me up and let me know and i will help you out with that so here's the middle piece here you guys that's one of them so i think now on this one yeah i gotta make this right here i gotta make the top and you know i did my half square triangles y'all see me do them numerous of times so i didn't feel the need to show you that i got videos on that so i gotta make sure i got it right y'all know i had to still take one of those a loose oh I did not have it right I thought that I thought that dog was scratching that said puppy playing with one of his toys my my granddaughter has a puppy a new puppy y'all and he is a mess he don't know how to go to bed like the other dogs he always he always into some but we gonna get him trained. We gonna get him. He gonna follow suit just like the other dogs. But anyway, his birthday is coming up, and that's what he wanted was a puppy. Um, he didn't feel like the puppies, the dogs that we had, was his dogs. Even though he got a big old husky out those, but he said he won't play no more. He's seven years old too. I bought him. They both was like four months old. Uh, well, not four months old. Uh, I bought him. I bought him. You know when he was ready to come home. But my grandson was four months old. And Ziggy's been with him ever since. He plays with him. He just don't play with him like Dominic wanted to. He he's not for the foolishness. It's not for the foolishness. You be like, oh boy, I ain't for that. I did not do that. How did I do that? That ain't gonna work. Let me see. I may have to be taking or doing some more of these. I wouldn't. Okay, there we go. There we go. I just didn't turn it the right way. There it goes, y'all. I got it. I got it. I got a little nervous there. I got a little nervous. Did I supposed to do something different here? Was it a certain way I supposed to do something? I read the instructions and I followed the instructions, y'all. Y'all, you know, I get she'll get credit just for that because I never follow instructions. But I'm trying to do better with that to do these sew alongs. I'm trying to try and do better with that. I'm trying to do what I'm told, y'all. Do what I'm told. Or asked. Let's put it that way. That didn't sound good. Do what I'm told. I think I gotta make, yeah, I'm gonna make two of those. Two of those. And here it is. This is my top piece. Ain't that cute? Ain't that cute? And it needs it seems open. Everything I, this whole block was uh to open the seams on it. So I'm going to do that. Because I'm gonna have to put the center piece in there. So it needs to be open. So I need to do another one of these, y'all. Bear with me, bear with me, bear with me. Need to do another one. 
and uh, then I can put one of these blocks together on camera. Then I put both of them, I put the other one together. And then, of course, you know, as always, I'll show you both of them on the wall. I'm really practicing on my seam allowance, paying attention to how I'm cutting, and the whole nine. That was the purpose also for these saw loans. Yes, it was. And I'm doing pretty good with it, so I'm pretty proud of myself. I mean, I go back to some bad habits sometimes, you know. We got bad habits. And uh, I go back to them sometimes. But basically, I'm doing what I'm supposed to do to learn what I need to learn. Yeah, I got it spot on that time, y'all. I didn't get nervous. I didn't have to get nervous. I figured it out. I really like this block. I really do. It's, it's a big block. The block turns out to be 15 by 15, yeah. It's supposed to be unfinished. That's what it's supposed to be. That's a big block. I hope y'all enjoyed my, um, enjoyed my little, um, hanky videos. I have... I've seen another lady do them, which is a lot easier than the way, a lot easier way to fold them than the original way. So I just may show you guys that one. I'm going to try it. I have put it aside for right now because I'm trying to figure out what am I going to do with my other blocks that I'm going to put with it. The hems, hem blocks. I have actually put them on, I actually put them on some extra hankies I had. Okay, y'all, I finger pressed that. Let me see. Let me see, let me see which way this is supposed to go. This one is going this way. Hmm. And this one. It's going that way. Okay, I'm gonna show you. We're gonna go ahead and put this together, y'all. We're gonna put this baby together. It's got a lot of seams in it. A lot of seams. We're gonna do some serious pinning here, y'all. Didn't open up these seams. I probably should have pressed this. But we're going to make it do what it do. It's okay. It's okay. Let me get the seam lined up here. And we'll go from there. Because this is the first seam right here that's going to that's, uh, button up to another one. I just got to make sure those other seams on the bottom. Uh, open see see we don't have to go to we gotta go way over here for another open seam y'all it's not bad it is not and i didn't open it up neither <coughs> excuse me y'all i still think i'm gonna do a little pinning on it may put one in the middle Put one in the middle. I think I'm gonna really, I really like this quilt so far. I like them all. I got, uh, I got the other one too. My, uh, I got another one and I'm really loving the fabric on it. It is so pretty, so, so pretty. Yeah, I'm gonna have to open these up because if I don't, I am going to sew them. I'm 
these these um couple of seams I did when I added those pieces. I didn't open the seam up. And those are the ones that's meeting, so I'm just gonna hit them here right quick, get them open up. Because if I don't, when I sew it, they are not, I'm not gonna have them open. So I'm just gonna hit that for a minute. Get those open. Okay, that's on no. Open them up on each end. Sorry about this, y'all. This video shouldn't be too long. Just get these seams open. One more. One more, y'all. Hold, hold your taters. Hold your taters. I'll be with you in just a minute. Okay, one more. I think. Well, okay. Two more. <laughs> I'm going to go ahead and open this. I mean, I finger pressed it, but I'm just going to hit it with the iron here. And I will come back and press it out once I get it fixed. Okay, so I'm sorry about that, y'all. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm going to sew it with all the seams up here. So I can keep my eye on them. So I can keep both good eyes on them and the crooked eye, too. All right. Here we go. Y'all know I'm a so slower. A uh, so slower. A <laughs> uh, so slow. 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 I'm going to get it right, y'all. Sore. Y'all do know that. I got some. Alright, I just got to make sure everything is lining up here. Need my stiletto. Cause this thing is running on my fingers. I got a lot of a lot. That does not look good. I may be coming back. Cause I got a lot of play in this right here. I'm gonna get to feed it all in. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see if it's gonna feed in. I probably should have did this on the bottom, so I could have fed it in. Let's see, I take this out to see what's going on here. See what's going on. Mm, that's gonna be all. Uh, all right, guys. I'm going to see what's going on, and I will be back. All right, guys, I'm giving you a close-up. I did not come back because, you know, all I had to do was put the tops, the top and the bottom on these blocks, and they were kind of off. But you can see maybe this one over here may not be right, but completely scraped. But, oh, well, once you get in the quilt and get quilted, you won't even notice it. But this is how the blocks look. Ain't they pretty? I like them. I was really excited about doing these blocks. Really was. So, as always, I'm looking to see if I got everything in order. Mm -hmm. Alright, I'll be back to talk to you in just a minute. But, I just didn't think you needed to see me put them together. You had seen mm -hmm. the biggest of, of me. Uh, putting these blocks together so just sewing those three pieces mm -hmm. I didn't feel like you had to see that but anyway I'll be right back okay everybody we are back I got my sidekick with me Miss Cookie we're having a nice fourth today aren't we Cookie 
Mm -hmm. yeah. I have. I go swimming. I get. I lay on my bed. I go swimming. I wear my hat and my suit. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you do all of that. She says she wear her swimming cap. She floats on her back, and all that. She's learning to swim. But anyway, the blocks are on the board over here. And it's I was, over there, Mama. It's over there, okay. Um, I was so excited to get them done. Oh, Mama, so and I did show, okay, let Mama talk. I did show you a close-up on them because I did not come back, as I told you. I did not come back to, for you to see me to put the top and bottom on the, uh, connect them to the middle. So that's my two blocks that I was so excited about doing. And I think they're so pretty. I really do. I'm loving this black and white quilt. So I will let you all go and enjoy your fourth. And me and Cookie is going to eat some barbecue and potato salad. Yes. <laughs> yes, we is. What is it? Oh, it's some macaroni and cheese. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna go make ourselves stuff. We're gonna go put ourselves in a coma. That's what we're going to do. But anyway, um, I know this the fourth will be over when you see this video. I pray that everyone had a safe and happy holiday, and we'll see you on the next video. Okay, cause you gonna say bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. <laughs>